Oh, there's another there's dog a, over there. There's a, a monster dog. <laughs> Justin. <laughs> I'm in Venice Beach with my dog Olive to meet up with Ross Butler, who stars in the Netflix film To All The Boys, P.S. I Still Love You. He loves his dog Justin and coffee, so we are headed to one of his fave dog-friendly cafes to talk movies. I'm Jason Dundas and this is Build Stopover. Come on. Who's this? Hey. Who have we got? This is Olive. What's up, man? What's up, dude? Nice Good to, to see, see you. you. This is Justin. How long have you had him for? Uh, by two years now. Don't you love how LA is so uh, dog friendly? Yeah, yeah, you can just take them anywhere. Yeah. Yeah, take them on hikes, take them to the beach. It's so, great. So on on most days off, like, do you, is this what you do? You hang out with your dog and chill? Yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll sit on the couch, watch movies, <laughs> walk around the neighborhood. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And jo Justin's a cuddler, though, so I'm mildly allergic to him, so when he cuddles, I, I break out in a little bit of hives, but. It's worth it. Like, I'll be sitting on the couch and he'll just come up and like rest his head on my head and... Oh, oh, oh. So this is your neighborhood, yeah? Yeah, yeah. So I live um, about like a five minute walk down that way. Yeah. Yeah, so I usually come here often and especially to this coffee shop. Okay, cool. Yeah. We're, and we're in Venice or Mar Vista? So this is technically Mar Vista, but yeah. Venice is like a mile and a half down that way. Okay, cool. So yeah. should we go to the coffee shop? Yeah, let's All check right, it out. Thank you. Coffee is really only two ingredients, right? So yeah. like, you can really bring out the taste if you isolate just the two ingredients uh, of just the water and the beans. And, right, right. Um, oh, so that's why you go black. Like it. Huh? Yeah, yeah, so you can really taste so it. So can you order the way that you like it? Oh, yeah. Would you open a coffee shop? I've actually been thinking about it. There's a, um, there's a board game cafe in Vancouver when I was shooting up there that, I, yeah. that me and the cast just kind of stumbled into. It was a movie I did with like Bella Thorne and what was the movie? Uh, it's called Perfect High, actually. Perfect High. Yeah. Is this it? Is this us, sir? So you're at it. Where, where, where have you been recently making movies? Um, so the last year, I was in San Francisco for 13. Uh, and then we shot 12 Boys 2 in Vancouver yeah. and New York. Right. Um, and then Shazam was in Toronto. So I've been like hitting all the major cities in yeah. North America. You've had a pretty, that's a pretty big 12 months. Yeah, it's been a lot. <laughs> it's, it's, it's been, uh, 2019 was an antisocial year for me. And it's also like uh, I'm transitioning into behind the, the camera type stuff. So I've been taking some time to learn more about production and, and directing and writing. So in regards to that, what do you want to, do you want to do the whole shebang? So you want to, he's going to spill that coffee on you. Uh, you want to write it, produce it, direct it, or is there a certain part of filmmaking that you want to get into? Um, right now, definitely like more uh, producing and writing. Um, acting is fun, but it, it, as far as like the creative aspect, like acting, you can make choices on the day and, and some creative choices, but yeah. um, I just want to be more involved from like the beginning of the project and, and how that uh, manifests into the final product. I mean, the stories I want to tell, I, I want them to be entertaining first mm. and foremost, but I also want them to uh, yeah, make make people that are mixed race or people that feel kind of out of place not feel so much out of place. That, that's something that we can all bond over is yeah. how we're all lonely in one way or another. Yeah. So tell me about 13 Reasons Why and what comes to mind when, when I bring that up. Um, it, it is definitely the most special project that I've worked on. It's the longest project I've worked on. It's a character that I've sat with for four years now. Um, and that show is really important because we just we, we didn't know the influence that it would have yeah. and we took the things that we wanted to see changed in the world and, and we talked to the writers and um we told the story through through culture because i think ultimately culture is what leads um how we act as humans like the things that we see uh on movies and in tv is how is a guideline for how we live our lives like yeah. when i was younger I had no idea how to ask a girl out on a date, so like all the rom-coms that I watched were kind of my guide. Let's talk about the new movie that you're mm. uh, essentially promoting because it's just hit on, right. on Netflix. Um, it's called To All The Boys, P.S. I, I Still, Still Love, Love You. you. Yeah. So tell me about this project. Uh, so it's a sequel to To All The Boys I Loved Before. Um, rom-com hit on Netflix. <laughs> yeah. And uh, it is a great movie. The first one was so funny, I loved it. Um, but yeah, the second one just kind of follows up. It's continuing the story, introducing a couple new characters, including my own. 
Well, here, here's a little fun fact. The high school that we shot in this movie was actually the same high school we shot Riverdale in. Oh, so, really? Yeah, so if you look at season one of Riverdale, there's, <laughs> there's like this one sitting area like by the cafeteria where it's like a, like a bunch of trees and it's like yeah. outdoor uh, lunch seating. We shot scenes in both of those locations. Uh, well, we shot, yeah, shot scenes in that same location for both season one of Riverdale and- Oh, there you go. Was like shh, shh, shh. I think uh, Justin's ready to roll. Yeah. <laughs> Justin's getting a little antsy. Yeah, right, maybe we should- uh... Come on. Okay. Well, thanks for hanging, man. Thanks yeah, for sharing stories and congrats nice on your you. career. Thank you. Thank and you, the man. new movie, which is on Netflix. You yeah. can check it out. Check it out cool. now. <laughs> All right, brother.